So what are spinal epidural pathologies? So what is the epidural space? It is an anatomically real space between the dura mater and the bony spinal canal. So you can see that this is the bony spinal canal here, right? And then there is a, this is an anatomical space, which is most of the times compressed, right? So rostrally, that is, you know, inferiorly, there is fusion of the spine and the periosteal layers of the dura mater at the foramen magna, which prevents intracranial infection. Caudally, it is fused up to the sacrococcygeal membrane and anteriorly, it is bound by the posterior longitudinal ligament, the posterior margins. This, this is the posterior longitudinal ligament, right? So, many times you must be writing that there is opacification of the posterior longitudinal ligament in your reports. So, it forms an important barrier for the epidural space, right? Then we have the posterior margins of the vertebral bodies and the intervertebral discs, which form the anterior border of the spinal epidural space. So this whole is the spinal epidural space, right? And then posteriorly, we have the ligamentum flavum, the capsules of the facet joints and the laminae. And laterally, we have the pedicles and the intervertebral foramen.